Well, I like to bring something when I got a, a guest as smart as you are. I got an idea for you. If this okay. country, we just saw that you mentioned the colonial. Uh, we, uh, we know uh, there was a big insurance company, very good insurance company that just paid ransom. The Foreign yep. Corrupt Practices Act is about stopping people from paying ransom. Shouldn't all of the cybersecurity companies like you get together, go to Washington and say, these companies, they've got to stop paying ransom. And that would then force them to go higher sale point instead of thinking they can get away with it. Well, um, let's just say that um, I'm sure you're familiar, you know, President Biden signed a new executive order all about cybersecurity. Right. It has impacts on those that do business with the government. It has impacts, I think, for all of us that are in the cyber market and how we reflect. I think, Jim, you're right on. I think what you're going to see is more collaboration between um, key players in cyber, between those players and key customers, I think particularly in infrastructure and in financial services, in the government. We've got to kind of bring the house, as it were, yes. to, to band together and say, how do we uh, put up better defenses? And it's not up to the commercial sector, obviously. It's up to the, to the government to potentially send some strong signals back that if you do this, there's repercussions. Yes. I think our yeah. job is to help our customers Customers protect themselves, and, and I think the government is ultimately going to have to help us. In I that agree. Fight. Don't miss a second of Mad Money. Follow at Jim Kramer on Twitter. Have a question? Tweet Kramer. Hashtag Mad Tweets. Send Jim an email to madmoney at CNBC.com or give us a call at 1 800 743 CNBC. Miss something? Head to madmoney.cnbc.com. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.